This is so nice. You know what? Yeah, the room. I put the room. We love oysters over here. I love you guys. She sees the whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 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 Thank I'm looking. Anyways, hey guys, it's your girl Courtney. Welcome back to my vlog channel. Yeah! Today it is Friday, April 21st. There is a lot happening. As you can see, I'm in a hotel room and we are actually about to go to another hotel room. And also, Xavier and Doris are here. Hi. I don't think they want to be my vlog because it the, don't seem like they like. I'm oh, sorry. I'm camera shy, so. Yeah. Okay. I'm in LA. Yes, yes, yes. If you watched my last vlog, you would know why I'm here. We are actually supposed to leave for Houston today. We changed our mind at the last minute. I don't want to go home. I don't want to go home. Okay. The last thing I want to do right now is go back to Houston and just sit in my apartment. We're not doing that. And I genuinely feel like LA is going to see more of me. Okay. Especially with summer. <laughs> Jesus! Dang. What were you releasing? You <laughs> Jesus! Oh my god. We are packed up and ready to go. Like I said, it is 4 p.m. Checkout was at 12. It's a three-star hotel, that's why. Okay. They don't care. Okay. Right now we're staying at the Hyatt Regency in Valencia, and I'm not gonna lie, I kinda hate it. The connection here for some reason is so bad. Like it's one, I've been trying to call an Uber for what? How long now? It's been like 10 minutes. We still waiting for a driver. But yeah, we're gonna be staying in a new hotel. We have like a little itinerary going for tonight and then also tomorrow. We're leaving on Sunday. So today we're just going to go to the pool. What is going on back there? Do do do. Bro, y'all look at my luggage. This is what I was going around with. This little blue luggage, pink one, and a yellow backpack. Florida. My friend said that it's given toys and tots. Toys and Tots is crazy. That was that. It's actually insane. I said, what? This is bougie. Uh, Wait, your luggage is nice. I got this because I did a brand deal. I forgot. With who? Is it oh, oh, away? And they sent me a bunch of stuff. Oh, I heard away is good. Yeah, and it's like inside, it's like you got good padding. So when I open my stuff, nothing's like destroyed. I don't know about yours, but mine's not, not just destroyed. Yeah, I got my luggage from Target and Amazon. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, y'all, I'll see y'all when the Uber gets here. It's gonna be a exciting vlog. That's one of the sausages. Oh, yes. Whoa. Oh, my God. This is insane. We just got to the hotel room. I cannot it's believe nice. it. It's nice. This is so nice. So, it, you know what it looks like? You ever seen like people that try to make futuristic yes, rooms? Yes, it's like giving future. Let me show y'all. Okay, so as you can see, um, Anyway, so you turn and you see the beds. Okay, we got the double beds. And then we have the bathroom here. Come on, lighting. Like, this is nice. This is the bathroom. Malin and Goetz. I don't know what that is. But look at this. This is the overview. It's so nice. Very spacious. Look at the little couch here. This is so nice. I love it. in a little place that we can work if we wanted to. A little mini bar. Wait, is that Casamigos? Is that alcohol, girl? What's going on? We getting lit tonight or what? This place is so nice. When we first got here, they actually were gonna offer us an upgrade, but someone took it. This room was available with a balcony and we were gonna get it. But yeah, this is my first time here. I love the vibe. It's actually a bit smaller than I expected, honestly, but I still really like it. The lobby area, I didn't expect it to be so little. It's kind of like tight. I think in general, this is just like a small hotel or something. Look at this. This is a little restaurant. I, you can see it. And then right here is like the pool. I'll see y'all in a few you when we decide what to do. You trying to do your little bureau? <laughs> Xavier, you're actually a hater. Like, how is it that you no, see me doing no, something? No, no, I, I hate him, but you be the man what's him about. This is not fair. Trying to get your bureau. He wanna know how she She's trying to get her bureau. She's trying to learn from me. You, but baby, you will never be me. Is this some form of bullying? Don't try to act innocent when the camera's on. What do you be mean? yourself. You always try I to switch myself. up. I am myself. You always try to switch up and act like you're so innocent when you talk to me, but you behind the cameras, you be bullying the hell out of me. And I have proof. I haven't done anything to this boy. Yes, you, you do it all the time. You be bullying me. What do I do to you? You call me a bitch? I got it on camera. <laughs> I don't know what he's talking about, y'all. Like, this is actually scaring me now. Like, I feel like he has this idea of me. Okay, see, she's the one who needs some help. She does. Let me grab my robe already. Wait, get out of the room! I put the robe in the house! Please! <laughs> you ran out of the room as soon as I said, I didn't even get to say robe. Because I didn't I said, even know. I said, you ran. Because I didn't know that this... Oh, 
door existed. Yes, that's why I'm exploring. Doris didn't make it. <laughs> I did. You smashed it from my hand. No, I didn't. Doris. Anyways, y'all, I got the robe. Get this rope to her. Stop. Sorry, guys. It got a little chaotic because, you know, when I go to hotels, I like to take the robe and feel a little money fit. to buy a robe. My B roll has me walking like this. <laughs> I know, he was calm. <laughs> he was like, I got a oh, no. <laughs> It was World War Three behind me. See, I'm not exploring no shit around y'all because y'all go rap like y'all got no damn sense. Sorry guys, sometimes I get a little excited. That's just the natural me. Boy, you better put that liquor down. Um, hi, I wanted to book um, spa services for tomorrow. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, bye. I don't know why I did that. Oh I don't know why I did that. Oh my god, I wish I got that on camera. Why did you just talk to him like that? Like he was some lover. What did I say? He said, okay, bye. Okay, bye. No, now I'm embarrassed that y'all noticed that. I was just trying to be gentle and nice. Femininity. Feminine. Not like that. That was like wild. It's time for dinner, and I'm going for a more natural look. It's just a top with some jeans and black bag, black heels, gold accessories, even though we got a silver necklace going on, but I don't feel like taking it off. We're going to this restaurant that's in this hotel, and so I'm gonna let y'all know how it goes. I'm sure you do. I'm irresistible. Let's go. You're heavy. That's what it is. Yours is the biggest. Let's your let's really acknowledge that. But yours is big. It's too big it's for your body. Big. We going, we going, we going. We love oysters over here. She hasn't even tried them before, but whatever. More for me. It is Saturday and we're on the way to dinner. We actually slept the entire day, it's actually insane. <laughs> but now we're going to dinner and then right after we're gonna be going to a comedy show. But yeah, we're very late to dinner right now. Hopefully they don't sell or take give away our table, but they always have reservations, so. And they give grace period. Yeah, we're gonna miss the grace period though. We're drinking a glass of wine tonight. Yeah, Doris was looking at Xavier. Xavier's getting some guy's number right now. Yes! It's a success. Xavier be pulling, okay? I ordered something with tuna. Okay, I ordered that, and I also got my filet as per use. Doris is trying steak for the first time. I am. Was that was so scary. Was it a success? I think it was a success. Wow. I was nervous. It was a success. Are you basically this guy that works here? He came up to Xavier multiple times just to make like small little small talk. Obviously he's interested, right? Xavier just went and got his number and it's a win, but he nervous. Don't overthink it. You look good. <laughs> I saw that. Your first time eating a steak. What does it feel like? The flavors. Are flavoring? Are flavoring. Yeah. yeah. The texture. It's texturing. It's, it's texturing. texturing. Yeah. Okay. The juice. No. It's juicing. It's juicing. juicing. Right. Yeah. The aroma has aroma. Okay. Yeah. Okay, period. I'm glad you like it. I love me a steak. You're like, that's my face? These girls don't come. What the fuck? You're in the air for an hour, like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> y'all, we just left the comedy show. What did y'all think? It was amazing, but the last person just made me just like, ugh, wake up. I w yeah, I wasn't a huge fan of the last person I'm that went. Find who the second to last person. Mm -hmm. So the second to last person that performed was amazing. If I can find his name, I'll put it here. And he's Nigerian. Woo -hoo! My people. But he was so. Funny, like I'm literally my stomach was hurting. Okay, yeah, and I was do you, you said I was laughing loud You were laughing like a good loud like it was nice. It okay. was like oh, uh, I know people saw us They were probably like they laughed so ugly <laughs> <laughs> No, but he was actually hilarious and I thought he was actually gonna be like the last person to perform uh -huh. But someone else went and it wasn't bad. It's just very old different school. Yeah, it's like old-school yeah. comedy and like very different styles like the person that was really good in my opinion He built up a story like he said something in the beginning and was still connecting it to the end of his jokes you know what i mean and then the person that went last he was just doing one-liners like just going back and forth it wasn't as funny to me because i like something with depth you know i love a joke that has depth but yeah now we're about to go home also somebody hit on me basically again oh yeah if xavier <laughs> has been pulling i don't know what's going on i literally don't do anything there's something in this that's, la air no but that's the thing you should be able to just do nothing and just be you exactly. and somebody just come this man just literally came up to and started talking to me and said my braids were nice and then we just started making conversation yeah but also you have to think about maybe this is the most you've actually gone out like when you come to visit la i feel like we always go to like one thing yeah this time around it's like we're consistently things. going to places. Yeah. yeah, I agree. I like that though. Yeah, but I I don't know. That's, That's why I like visiting LA more than living here because I feel like when you live here, you're very inclined or you're more inclined to want to go home after one activity. Yeah. But like visiting, it's like you want to make the most of the trip. What you have, yeah. Because yeah. you're only staying here like probably like a week or so. Yeah. Said so we're going home now. This was a fun night. <gasps> this is the guy that was hilarious. Hilar like 10 out of 10 funny. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Ciao. Our last day. Oh, okay, yes, tomorrow is our last day. Okay, yeah, so tomorrow, let me tell y'all the plan. We're going to brunch and then going to our flight. Yes. You can say hi now, this is your moment. Oh, yeah. Don't let people see your shine, you shine every day. I'm crying inside. <laughs> <laughs> 